like, yo, listen, bro, I hope this video finds you well. I hope you're taking care of yourselves, drinking a lot of water, going to the gym, just overall being a good you, bro. And even if you're not, it's all good. You don't, it's not too late to start, bro. <laughs> I just wanted to, to remind y'all that, yo, it's, it's June 1st, bro. Like, get to your grind, homie. It's not too late, bro. But anyways, today we have a crazy video. Off of the title alone, the dude in his video brought his whole family to his, like, girl's family to get along. And he proposed to her. And this is how it played out. I, I haven't watched this. I don't know what this is about. But to be honest, I'm scared. Because y'all know how my videos get down, man. They're usually crazy. Uh, with that being said, let's, let's, let's get into it. Okay, before my boy gets to it, listen, if I'm bringing out my family, right, not just my mom, not just my dad, but my family, my entire family, to meet your family, bro, we're getting married, bro, we had, we have to have, like, kids on the way or something, we have, it would have to be, like, a, a marriage or something, bro, it, ha it has to be something serious, there is literally no fucking way this goes south, bro, and if, because if it does, you're not just gonna get haunted by this yourself, your family was there to view and see all of it. That's like the craziest and saddest part about this. If it goes south, dude, you're gonna, <laughs> this shit is going to be awkward for the rest of your life, bro. I'm scared. I'm sorry. I just get paranoia from my own videos, bro. Like I get scared to open and finish these clips thoroughly through because they're all, <laughs> let me shut up, bro. This is going to be all our family. Relax. This is going to be all my family. Oh my god. Yeah! Yeah, this already went south, bro. She's not hugging him or anything. she said yeah off of my boy's look bro listen listen homie if this is a girl you've been dating for for a good amount of time and her family is willing to pop out with your family and she still says no she's fucking somebody else bro it is what it is i don't know what to tell you to be honest hey man you're braver than me bro i don't think i would be able to live with myself knowing that this happened to me i think this is probably one of the most no this is the most awkward shit that can ever happen to any man bro and matt yo Put this in perspective. Imagine you bring your family, your your entire family, bro, your granny, your mother, your sister, just to get rejected, bro. Yeah, man, that's the end of my life, bro. It is what it is. Fuck the real. I don't give a f yo. Let me shut up and watch the full video so I can get the whole context of this shit, bro. <laughs> We can fix that. What is she say? That's the thing that's I can't hear her, bro. What is she saying? Damn, 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 bro, damn. Fuck. I pray to God this never happens to any of y'all, bro. But this is worse than getting beat up. This is worse than losing your job. This is worse than getting robbed. I'm not gonna lie. My question is, why did she say no, bro? What? Like, a as a man, you should know if your girl's gonna say yes or no to you proposing. It it's not that hard to, to expect, bro. It, it really isn't. If you're in a healthy relationship for a prolonged period of time, then you can, like, think and, and mentally know that she's going to say yes and then you can risk it and do this shit but if if you've been like fucking around you've been having toxic whatever the fuck or if you know she's like 
a tweaker, bro. She might have cheated on There's no point in bringing your whole family, bro. Holy shit, the embarrassment. I, I'm not even the type of person to care about people's opinions, but this is your family, bro. I don't give a fuck what your mom, dad, or whoever your family is. I don't give a fuck what they say. They're always going to think of you as, as like a loser, to like, like, a, like a little bit, bro. They're always going to know that you got rejected in front of everybody. Holy, I don't want to watch the rest of this video, bro. This shit is too awkward. <laughs> Hell nah, bitch. Don't stand next to me, bro. Push that bitch away, bro. <laughs> Yo, nah, bro, you did not just embarrass me in front of everybody and you still, nah, bro, at that point, we're breaking up right there. You might as well inform everybody that you're done, bro. I'm sorry. I don't give a fuck how long the relationship is. There's no woman in her right mind that actually loves you that would put you through this type of embarrassment, bro. Not even embarrassment. That would humiliate you like this, bro. This is, this is literally like worse than walking around naked in public. This is, <laughs> this is worse than, I don't know, man. I just don't, this is terrible. This is like, <laughs> and I don't know what my man did, so he might have deserved it, but I, still, bro. But you're not standing next to me. What the fuck? If you don't get away, we're done, bro. Throw the entire relationship away, bro. It is what it is. That's the end of it. That's the end of that shit. <laughs> That's the end of the video. Damn. Holy fuck. Imagine bringing your whole family to see... You propose to the woman of your dreams, the woman that you love, just to have her say no in front of- Yeah, bro, she must be cheating on you or something. I don't know what to tell you, homie. That's- Oh, hell nah. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm jumping off a bridge after that one. I, I'm not living on myself, bro. I'm killing myself. <laughs> what? I would not be able to live with that, bro. I don't give a fuck how well off I am or how much I love this girl. If that ever happened to me, bro, my ego would be the death of me. It is what it is. Or not even ego, my self-respect and humiliation and, and just, yeah, I'd die, bro. Yeah, let me know what you guys' thoughts and opinions are of this video. Let me know, like, what you would do if you're in this situation. Uh, God for you must be some type of, like, I don't know how you end up in this situation, bro. Let me know what y'all would do if this actually happened to y'all. It's been Spirit. Follow my Twitter, Spirit underscore. And uh, yeah, I'm out.